So, I just wanted to do a quick video. I've seen some uh, some queries on Live Community uh, talking about two-factor authentication with Cortex XOR. So, as there is a, a integration already there for Duo, I thought I'd go through the Duo side of things. On the Duo side. Basically, what I can really say is you've got to enroll your user. This isn't going to be anything to do with Duo. You have to enroll your user and go through that. That's really simple and straightforward. And the application you're looking for is Protect an application, and you're looking for Auth API. Then you click Protect. Um, that's pretty much it as far as the, the Duo thing is concerned for, for this video. You kind of just, it, it's really simple and straightforward. Um, so if I click that, you'll see that these match up, um, and don't bother trying these because I, uh, I'm not going to use this one. I'll bin this one now. Um, but these will match up the API hostname, so key integration key, with the integration on XOR. So it's actually really intuitive and really simple to to follow. So I'll remove that. Okay. Right. Um, so now we'll do the configuration on XOR itself. Okay, and then we're going to tick for use, two factor login to the Misto. Um, can put require use just an additional password, but then that's an additional password if you can see that they have to log in there. I don't really see the point. You've got the username, the user password, and then the two factor push. Let me test that. That's all good. Success. Okay, now because the user is on uh, on Duo, and that's already set up. Now, so now we'll log in as me. And because that will make an API call in the background and use that username. Duo knows that it's me, it sends back the response that it's me, and I should get a prompt as I do. I'll request a push message, which I will accept on my phone. And then I'm logged in. That literally is it. That's, that's the top and bottom of it. It's really that simple. Um, there are some commands associated with it as well. So you can duo check um, I think that's the only one that takes duo check Yep, and that comes back with a status OK, so that's just checking to make sure it's connected. Then you have, you can check the authentication as well. Do you authenticate uh, factor push uh, username equals me. And then that will send me, that makes the call, gets me to receive a approve request on my phone, then approved, logging in, and all working very well. So really, it's really, really simple. Um, and to be honest, the Duo system, I, to be fair, it's the quickest I've used. It's the simplest to understand when you're going through it. And it's also the most reliable, plus, for free, you can get up to 10 users. Okay, it's a little restricted, but you can get up to 10 users. Um, so that's, I mean, that's that's more than enough for for uh, for what I'm doing and, and for most families or, or so, and even small, really small businesses. So it's well worth doing. It does add that second layer of protection, and that is massively important in this day and age. So I hope that helps. Um, if any questions, please post them below, uh, subscribe, check out my website.